So the challenge today is, can we, with our new school technology, beat their old school car? Yeah, but over this kind of nasty terrain, they can just go straight there. The roads go all the way around these huge cliffs. The horses could cut straight across country to the finish line seven miles away, but they would be going across some of the roughest terrain in America. Our cars would be traveling on paved roads the entire way, but have to travel a full 46 miles to the finish. And keeping the spirit of the Pony Express, where riders would have to hand off mail-filled satchels to each other mid-gallop, we'd be using leather saddlebags for our relay race. I would begin the race in the boss, and then make the handoff to Rutledge and the Roush at the halfway point 23 miles down the road. The second rider was also staged halfway to the finish line, waiting for the handoff from Buzz and Johnny Cash three and a half miles away. The starting line was on a perfectly straight stretch of road, but tragically, the speed limit was 25. Three, two, one, go! And that's 25. That's all I can do. What? No! No! This sucks! And off he goes. While I was stuck at 25, Buzz and Johnny Cash galloped off, heading straight across the grasslands to the edge of the mesa, three miles away. 25 miles an hour on such an epic road. Buzz and Johnny Cash had already covered a mile and were just two and a half miles from the handoff point. But the boss was about to be unleashed. Because just ahead was a 75 mile an hour zone. All right, here comes my line. Oh, yes. It sounds like the engine is right basically between my feet. It's really a nice sound. The shifting is super positive. It really is fast. But what you notice about this car is how composed it is. There's no drama. Even the way the engine picks up its speed. I'd managed to make up time as I took advantage of everything modern technology had to offer, and we were back in the game. Buzz and Johnny Cash were recreating the past at 10 miles an hour. And for the first time in this race, the boss had the advantage. Then the road began snaking down to the valley below. I know Mustangs are great in a straight line, but in the corners, I had my doubts.